they're not very confident in it. They kind of joke about it and they, they call it the shake and bake, you know. They say if, you know, that fire doesn't pass fast, that's what they're going to bake in and that's exactly what happened in the Yarnell fire. You're in there praying, pretty much. Everybody sees God when they're in the shake and bake tent. And this is the current fire shelter that's being used throughout our country. It only protects you up to maybe 500 degrees. By treating this blanket with a technology that I have, uh, along with a NASA-based uh, fire blanket, okay, we're able to increase the protection three times of what it is currently. Like in the Yarnell fire, those guys didn't have a chance once they got under the fire shelter. There's no way. Well, I think the Yarnell fire uh, tragedy affected millions of people. You know, they looked at that and they go, wait, these guys are running into situations to save us. And, you know, when you talk to a firefighter face to face that's doing it, and, you know, you know it's no joke. They got fear, but they're really courageous, let's put it that way, you know, and they will push the envelope to make things go right to save another being, or structure, and stuff like that. To help support this effort, we're gonna save, I don't know, maybe hundreds of future firefighters. At Sunseeker, we want to provide these new fire shelters for firefighters across the country. But we need the money to develop and produce the necessary prototypes for testing. That's why we're launching a crowdfunding campaign at sunseekerfireblanket.com, where we can raise funds from those who care about firefighter safety, as well as people who want access to these revolutionary new materials. We're offering rewards for donations, so you can take home some of this technology for your own protection and safety while helping save the lives of firefighters. And on behalf of America's firefighters and myself, we want to thank you so much for your help. They're gonna keep on talking about how he was strong.